decision very early. I could produce change from my travel brand. Because I actually can help you with the and inspiring and all that stuff is well and good, but it's not nothing that'll get me wrong. But you definitely can't live like that in this country. I also remember being scared. situation everything that's going on you just accept it take it and if you really really like making videos you will always find a way to make them take you always use your current resources bawa ji take it let's do it hey everybody so uh my name is munim shah and uh, this is my second youtube video and to be honest with you guys i don't really know what it's going to be about i just knew that i had to make it Uh, for a while now, I've been telling myself that I was going to be uploading more consistently on YouTube. However, that hasn't happened, so this is my attempt at doing that. I really don't know where this video is going to go, but uh, I hope you'll still follow along with me. So I'm 22 years old, and uh, I'll be going on 23 next month, so that's exciting. But also kind of scary because I have no clue what I want to be doing, and uh, I have some idea. Actually, no, to be honest, uh, I know that you know media, photography, videography is something that I'm genuinely interested in, and that has some. Oh, hey, look, she's way better than me at that. <laughs> But um, uh, yeah, so here are some of my photos, just to give you guys who don't know my work a little bit of a glimpse into who I am. I've uh, traveled all over the world, uh, Thailand, Pakistan, Amsterdam, so you know I'm well traveled, at least I like to think so, and um, that's definitely something that I think needs to be uh, explored a little bit more in my life. However, you know, with COVID and everything going on right now, I don't really think that's going to be a possibility for a while. Um, even though I know that this is what I want to be doing, I am in school for computer science and that's something that I've struggled with for a while you know I don't I don't come from an affluent family um, both my parents are immigrants they grew up in Pakistan and I came over here when I was about three years old so all I've really known is America don't get me wrong I've gone back to visit family back home in Pakistan you know a few times uh, however you know this is where I'm from this I'm very American even compared to my siblings because I came here fairly young they're a bit older than me so they have more of that connection to back home And I feel like uh, that's another thing that I like to kind of explore on this channel is the dichotomy of growing up with uh, different backgrounds and different influences, you know, because being raised, I was told, you know, I wasn't told, I was kind of like, you know, well, yeah, I guess I was told, but like, hey, you're Pakistani, you're Muslim, you know, these are the characteristics you're supposed to embody. And I, I feel like I did that fairly well and I never really questioned anything because, you know, as a kid, you don't really have you're not really at the point where you can you can contemplate you know identity in that way you're still kind of busy forming it at least i was that was my experience i feel like you know that's something that most people who you know have this uh, who grew up in two different cultures could hopefully relate to and um, i think that that's something that needs to be talked about more and like kind of the effect that that has on an individual the personality the way they view things how they approach problems it's all really different and um So I think that's another aspect of this channel. If you're interested in that, subscribe because you know those are the things that I'm going to be talking about and exploring a little bit more. Hey everybody! Thanks for clipping on my. <laughs>